there's actually multiple ways to identify a lion's age. The first and most obvious method is the mane, nose pigmentation, facial scarring, teeth wear, and jaw slackness. These are some of the best methods to help identify a lion's age. The first age group are lions that are aged from 1 to 2.9 years old. From 1 to 12 months old, a lion is still considered a cub. Once the cub surpasses a year old, it would be considered a mature cub. The second age group are aged from 3 to 4.9 years old. Once a lion reaches the age of 2, he can no longer be considered a cub, but now be referred as a sub-adult. The age range for sub-adults can fluctuate at times, but the usual range is from 2 to 3 years old. But you can also see from multiple studies that I'm showing right now, they can be ranged from 2 to 4 years old. At age 4, they can be considered as a young adult as well. Because keep in mind, if a lion is anywhere from 2 to 4 years of age, he isn't fully grown. Speckles or speckling will start to become more visible when a lion reaches the age of 3. Any younger than that, their noses are completely pink with no freckles whatsoever. The easiest trait to identify a sub-adult lion is the mane. At sub-adulthood, sub-adults possess a very awkward appearance. Their manes would have a very gangly look or basically they have mohawks. However, you should never use one trait to age a lion as individuals can differ. Nose pigmentation is a more surefire method as it gets darker or more filled out with age. As a sub-adult anywhere from 2 to 4 years, the majority of their nose would be pink. The color pink would be the most prominent color and it overpowers the smaller percentage of black pigmentation. Their teeth are still typically white with minimum yellow. One thing I forgot to mention is that there have been few instances where young cubs or sub-adults have been recorded to possess a black nose or a dark nose. It doesn't usually happen but it can happen. Reason for this as of right now it remains a mystery but the concept of the cubs or sub-adults having a black nose is actually false turns out they're actually gray in color in certain lighting it can appear black but it isn't actually black it's just gray but with no pigmentation Third age group are lions that are aged from 5 to 6.9 years old. Now in their prime, lions are at their physical peak, the most successful or productive period. They look their best and they are at their strongest. During this time period, it's also the most valuable time of their life in terms of sustainability for their population as a whole. It's here lions are now fully grown and appear massive and bulky and are fully developed. But surprisingly, lions aren't actually fully matured until the age of 7, but they're still very much mature during their prime. As a rule of thumb, when a lion reaches the age of 5, that's when they first enter their prime, their nose would be 50% black or filled with black pigmentation and the other 50% of the nose will be pink. Very basic and quite easy. So if you look at an adult lion with his nose looks evenly distributed via pink and black colors look equal in distribution, you're looking at a prime lion. On another side note, at age 5, a lion is fully grown but their manes aren't. A lion would have to wait until the age of 6 years old for their manes to completely fill out and become fully mature. Also during this 5-6 to six year range, lions tend to look their most majestic and handsome during this time. The last age group, at age 7 and onwards, a lion is considered aged or old. At 7 years of age, a lion's mane will start to lose condition, so it's no longer at its best. But, the mane's overall condition would still be good. As I mentioned earlier, lions are generally considered to be fully mature mentally at age 7. At age plus, which is the last year of a lion's prime, 
the lion's mane visibly loses more condition and usually starts losing body condition or muscle mass. It's relatively easy to identify an old lion. Some look the part being visibly old, but some, if well taken care of, looks in really good condition and doesn't look old at all. The most used method to determine if a lion is old or past their prime is nose pigmentation. At age 7 or 8 plus, the nose will be fully filled out. Or in other words, an old lion's nose would be black, not pink. Their muscle tone will start to decline and they would appear smaller than younger males. The mane also becomes much darker and envelops more on the mane. The mane itself loses condition and the hairs become very thin and has a wiry or frazzled look. Old male lions also show wear in their canines possess heavy facial scarring and lastly, they usually have a very slack jaw expression, meaning their lower jaw is dropped or hanging. Unlike younger males who would have a tight jaw, the older a lion gets, the more slack his jaws get and drops. And that brings me to the first question. And the question was, um, somebody noticed very observantly that uh, lions differ in the coloration on their noses. So when he asked, he said, well, I've seen lions and some of them, their noses are entirely pink. Uh, other lions, their noses are entirely black on this little T piece over there. And others like, or Megs are almost black, um, and others are speckled. So a little bit of pigmentation on the pink. And he wanted to know, did that mean anything uh, significant? Um, so the answer to that is yes, it's very significant. And in fact, uh, you can use the pinkness on the nose or the um, pigmentation that a lion has on its nose to determine its age. So to start off with, when the lions are born, their noses are completely pink on that little T piece there. And then as they get older, there's more and more freckles or pigmentation that starts to develop on that nose. And then when you get to a ripe old age like Meg um, of 13, uh, that pigment is entirely filled out so it's almost entirely black so you can tell an age of a lion um, merely by looking at its nose